welcome back to the Crypto Trust Network, where we decode the cryptic world of cryptocurrencies. If you're hungry for the latest and most electrifying crypto news, you're in the right place. Smash that subscribe button, ring that bell, and let's embark on today's thrilling crypto journey. Today is January 28th, 2024. First, the di digital currency titan that I want to talk about is XRP. Yes, I like XRP. I'm a huge proponent of XRP, what it can do um, financially, what it's doing and resolving the problems that it's solving with the you know, monetary system and banks using it and everything that goes along with it. It's making waves. It sure is. Analysts are buzz with the predictions with predictions of momental surge sparked by Ripple's potential IPO, groundbreaking crypto legislation and Seismic event of Bitcoin having. As I said, all these things are going to bubble into one. And then imagine XRP soaring to the moon. Hitting $2 probably by sometime mid of this year. And then by the end of the year, I would, be, I would not be surprised if it's above $3. The air is electric. With possibilities, but remember, in the crypto cosmos, every high has risks. Stay tuned as this folds and we figure out what happens. Because people are predicting all sorts of things the fair market value of XRP and it's going to 500 and this and that. No, I, at least I don't think so. I would love nothing more for it to do that because. That would um, make a lot of people happy, a lot of millionaires. But I think by the end of the year, we'll be around three dollars. By mid this year, probably June, July, we'll be around two dollars. Next, let's talk about Solana, the dark horse of the crypto race. I didn't see this one coming. Um, yes, I own Solana. I have Solana. I've had it since it was. 510 something on those lines and but did not see it you know peaking like it has been with all the meme coins and the phone and everything that's been going on I did not see this one coming it's charts are painting a picture that's reading towards a bull a bullish outlook that's ready to go if the trend holds, it might, you know, go towards that historic and coveted mark of $100. This is more than numbers, though. It's a story of resilience and triumph, yeah, as far as Solana is concerned. Because, like I said, I didn't even see this one coming. Um, I thought, yes, it was going to be popular, but not with everything that it has done and I think meme coins have helped it quite a bit and now a tale of intrigue and strategy Bitcoin 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 this weekend Bitcoin showed a tantalizing upwardness of a 42 hinting at a you know a bullish outlook but as the choice we're possibly entering a phase of mysterious consolidation, I think, that's going to happen. Watch closely as the Bitcoin ETF inflows and the enigmatic heavy in April unfolds. This is not just a market movement, it's a battle of wits and patience, especially with Bitcoin, because there's a lot of suppression that's going on. So don't forget... That yes, we're going to be doing well, especially after the halving. As you can see, the halving is in 72 days, 16 hours away. So we will get there, but you know, when do we get there? How quickly we get there? 
those are things that have to be decided so what I want to talk about next is what do we expect as far as Ethereum is concerned because Ethereum is hovering between 2000 and 2300 well as far as Ethereum is concerned and I think with layer 1 solutions and uh, layer 2s and layer 1s I'm expecting you know Ethereum to be at its peak in the bull market somewhere around you know six seven thousand maybe seventy five hundred is what I'm expecting uh, Ethereum to be I mean I wouldn't mind if it goes above that but I think that is where it's most likely heading so that's my Ethereum outlook because I don't see a lot a lot of things happening with Ethereum because Ethereum is starting to rely on these layer 1s and layer 2s quite a bit more to do what it needs to now let's take a look at this article Fed rates uh, Fed rate cuts poss possible in March before Bitcoin having like I said this these Fed rates are supposed to come right the Fed will make its in initial interest rate decision for 2024 and let's expect first rate cuts by March and that will likely boost the price of Bitcoin so as you can see there's you know quite a bit of uh, like indication that 96.9% indicate this point towards an expectation of unchanged interest rates as well. So it's not a guarantee that these rates will change, but everybody's expecting these rates to change. So if, if, if there's a rate cut, yes, the price will spike. You know, by the rumors of the news, maybe something like that happens also. So keep that in mind. But I have a feeling that maybe they're not because everybody, when I, when every, when everyone is talking about something, it usually doesn't work out the way that every everybody is portraying it. Yes, maybe you know ten twenty percent time, and maybe this is one of those times. But most of the time, somebody's you know screaming from the rooftops and screaming from the mountains that there's a rate cut coming in. Right before the Bitcoin halving, it doesn't happen. But if it happens, I wouldn't be surprised if Bitcoin goes above 50. Because with the halving and the rate cut and everything with the ETFs sh should have stabilized, uh, I'm also expecting Grayscale to kind of slow down on their dumping of BTC on exchanges. So I think all of that is, you know, going to make a nice case for Bitcoin to go bonkers and go through the roof, skyrocket, whatever you want to call it. And of course, all coins follow. So keep that in mind. Um, but nothing is a guarantee. But after Bitcoin... Yes, the price will start ticking up. Even if there isn't a rate cut, even if they stay with the same thing, things like that. So keep that in mind. Things like that, when that happens, you have to be cognizant of the fact that there's a lot of suppression, there's a lot of manipulation by these big companies and uh, even the SEC with everything that they do and they they try to bring down the price of crypto and bring down the market as a whole there's there's some very you know important cases that are going on the xrp case needs to get wrapped up coinbase versus sec that decision of dismissal that needs to get wrapped up if that gets dismissed then i think we're you know then it's going to the moon so to speak right so keep that in mind but all in all, you know, do your own research. Nothing in this channel is financial advice. It's all for educational purposes. 
Please comment on what your thoughts are about this video, about the price predictions, things that go on those lines. So we can talk about anything further that you might like to talk about. So there you have it. My Crypto Explorers. Today's journey through the labyrinth of crypto news is just the beginning. In this world of digital gold, your passion is your compass. Smash that like button, share your thoughts in the comments, and join us again for another thrilling crypto odyssey. Until next time, keep your crypto passion blazing. See you.